Welcome to the midpoint of the MLB season. The 94th All-Star Game was held in Arlington, Texas. A beautiful start to the game as Cody Johnson respected America with a beautiful rendition of the Star Spangled Banner. God bless America, y'all. We all can breathe easy last night knowing that Angel Hernandez, Mr. Unpredictable, did not call balls and strikes behind home plate. Thank God for that, right? Starting pitcher for the National League, Pittsburgh Pirate Paul Skeens. He is the youngest to grace the mound first since Dwight Gooden in 1986 and the fifth rookie to do so since Nomo in 95. Tip of the hat goes out to Juan Soto, New York Yankee batter. Paul Skeens threw a 100 mile per hour heater inside on Soto and Juan didn't flinch. He didn't even move. That is bravery personified inside that batter's box. Soto, you got my respect. Now here comes a debate. I want everyone to comment on this debate. Otani versus Babe Ruth. I will not disrespect George Herman Ruth. He did all his accomplishments on beer and hot dogs without computers and tech. Let me know, comment what you think. Shohei did show off in the third inning. A 400-foot, three-run homer blast with an exit velocity of 104 miles an hour. Wow! Now, I want to know Babe Ruth's home run exit velocity, wouldn't you? Bryce Harper, my man, showing off his glove at his new position at first base, taking a short one-hopper like a veteran. Eight-time All-Star and two-time NL MVP playing as an outfielder in the past. Also, he had a double last night. Well done, sir. Last place, Oakland A's. There's positive coming. Hold on for it. A fans, you have a reason to smile. Pitcher Mason Miller holding the fastest pitch recorded this season, 103.7 miles an hour. That's not a fastball. That's a flamethrower. Unreal pitch. He also struck out Shohei Otani last night. That's something to tell your grandkids. Red Sox, Jaron Duran going long ball. A two-run home run blast putting AL up. 5-3 in the midpoint of the game. Yesterday was the All-Star Game, and tonight is the World Series. I paused. I wanted, to let, I wanted that to sink into all of you. It's not a joke. It's the real thing. Let me get into it. Texas Hold'em, World Series of Poker. Final table is tonight. Fighting for the first place prize of $10 million. Every player that does walk away from the final table will get a cash prize of at least $1 million. Are you watching? Are you interested? Comment below on that. Reds, De La Cruz. Stolen base total of 46 so far. He surpassed many MLB total teams. Are you serious right now? Wow. He is the new generation Ricky Henderson back in the Oakland A's. Braves Ozuna, he leads the NL with 77 RBIs. Unfortunately, he stranded two runners in the seventh inning. Royals machine, Bobby Witt Jr., he pumped out an amazing MLB leading 125 hits so far, but nothing to contribute to the AL team. No assistance was necessary as the five unanswered runs by the AL was enough to beat NL 5-3. If I missed anyone's team, I meant no disrespect. Let me know who your team is. I've got the second half of the season highlights coming up for you on this channel. Like, comment, subscribe. God bless America.